everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. Today I'm going to be doing my go-to makeup look. I don't do this as my like everyday routine, like going out to like the city or to like breakfast or whatever. This is what I do when I have like an occasion, like a special dinner or like a party that I need to go to and I have no idea what I want to do with my face. So this is my go-to look and I hope you guys enjoy it. First off, I'm going to take this Babor Daily Purifying Cream and I'm just going to massage that into my face. After that, I'm going to take my L'Oreal Lumi Magique Face Pure Light Primer to give my skin a subtle glow. Once I've added the primer, I'm going to take the L'Oreal Infallible Foundation in Radiant Beige and I'm just going to buff that into my skin using a flat top buffing brush. Once I've applied my foundation, I'm going to take Maybelline New York Instant Age Rewind in Fair Claire and add that to any high points of my face to give a highlighted effect. I'm going to be buffing that into my skin using a Real Techniques contour brush. For powder, I'm going to be using NYX HD Studio Photogenic in Translucent and I'm going to be applying that with a large fluffy brush. So I can make the eyeshadows more vibrant, I'm going to be using NYX eyeshadow base in white and I'm just going to be patting that all over my eyelids. For eyeshadow, I'm going to be taking the Estee Lauder Deluxe Eyeshadow Palette in number 47, Honey Drop, and patting that on my eye with a flat shader brush. Next, so I can darken up the crease a little bit, I'm going to be taking number 38 Chocolate from the same Estee Lauder Palette, and I'm just going to be adding that to my crease. And I'm going to be using a Napoleon Purtis Eyeshadow Definer Brush. I'm next going to be taking a crease blending brush just to blend out that brown eyeshadow. Once I've finished blending, I'm then going to take chocolate on the small eye definer brush and just place that on my lower lash line. Next, I'll be taking a black eyeshadow on a small eye definer brush and just doing the same thing that I did with the dark brown eyeshadow. To blend out the black eyeshadow, I will be taking a dense blending brush and just working that into my crease. To be adding a bit of shimmer to my eye, I will be adding the NYX Roll On Shimmer in Nude. And I will just be placing that on my eye and then patting it out with a flat shader brush. For eyeliner, I am just taking NYX Gel Eyeliner in Jet Black on an angled eyeliner brush from e.l.f. and I'm just going to do a semi-dramatic wing. For mascara, I'm just taking Maybelline's New York's Illegal Length Mascara and just coating my lashes once with this. I am then going to take Too Faced Brow Envy Kit in Brunette and an angle brush and just fill in my eyebrows like normal. I am then going to take Chi Chi Super Lashes and apply them as usual. For contour, I'm just taking NYX Matte Bronzer in Medium and just putting it under my cheekbones, under my jawbone and around my forehead just so I can give my face a more defined look. For my lips, I'll be taking Chi Chi's Totally Nude Lip Liner and outlining my lips with this and also filling them in. Seeing as I have quite large lips already, I will not be overdrawing them. For my lips, I will just be taking this peach colour and just applying that to my lips. To be finishing off the lips, I'll be taking NYX Butter Gloss in Tiramisu. To be finishing off the look, I'll be taking Mary Luminizer by The Balm and just putting that on all the high points of my face. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time.